All right, so we're checking out the only game where a leisurely drive through Niceville will end up with a harpoon going up somebody's butt. It's Happy Wheels. No more Mr. Niceville, damn it. So this is like Happy Wheels has gone into job simulator mode. We have to deliver Coke products to the various <laughs> denizens of Niceville. Now, obviously nothing bad could happen in Niceville. You may say to yourself, Gray, is that a man missing his face in front of Ron's drugs? Nonsense. He was born that way and he's just resting. He gets very upset when people assume that he's been shot in the face with two very large caliber rifle rounds. Those just happen to be there. Can you believe it? Some bastard threw a freaking rock through this window. Ah, uh, we're coming up on the 21st annual Murderville go-kart race. Every once in a while, you have two parents that have a little spat out in front about whose child crossed the finish line first, but I'm sure they'll come to some sort of agreement here without someone getting shot in the face. Now, I know what you're asking. You're asking, but great, can anyone join the go-kart race? Of course they can. Let's help little Susie along here. I see that some, uh, some parents have brought their children. No! Oh, looks like someone tripped on a blade. And what do you know? There was a couple of landmines laying around. Little Tom Hardy is over here taking a nap in this puddle of strawberry jam while his father fixes his go-kart. Now, I did see that there's another mine here, so I'm gonna see if we can go ahead and trigger this with the uh, remains of these random brains that happen to be on the ground. Now, whenever you find a, a random set of brains like this, you wanna you wanna just kind of nudge them along, okay? You don't wanna you don't wanna manhandle these things. Now, nope, this girl's disembodied leg is in the way. There we go. Yay, we won. Looks like we have some uh, t tacos with ketchup on it rolling down the road here. That's nice. Now you may be saying to yourself, great, is that a man hanging a woman from a... Oh, she's... <laughs> I was gonna say she was flutter kicking on my car. I'm not gonna lie. I wanna see if I can kill this farmer with the lady that's stuck on the front of my car. Hold on here. And launch it. That did not work as I had anticipated. It was like San Francisco over here, Jesus. It's kind of rare when I see an ax that isn't in someone. <laughs> All right, we've now entered Niceville. You always know that you're entering Niceville because there's typically some human body part there to welcome you. All right, so what are things like in Niceville? Look at these cars. Wow, going a little slow for my taste though. That's right, we can move things along here. Finally, my cocaine is here. Oh, I thought it was like Coca-Cola. And that right there is a job well done. Okay, now this is 99% impossible. Instead of normally getting harpoons up the ass, we're going to be getting them in the groin. But I've done this for a long time. All right, you wanna get low. Low. Ready for this? First try. Oh, oh, ho, ho, hey. If he's still screaming, that means he's still alive. I always wanted to try a bottle flip challenge. Don't worry, all these bottles are already empty. All right, ready? They call me Haculus! Yeah, son of a bitch! Yeah! Oh, 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 oh! I mean, I, I don't even know. I don't really know if I could outdo that, but I mean, I guess I could try. I should have stopped when I was ahead. Okay. That, uh, that, okay. God, I wanna make that happen up here. That moment when you do a bottle flip and it lands on the corner. <laughs> Went right off the board. <laughs> okay, now come on. I gotta at least get a golf clap for that. Getting closer. <laughs> oh, oh. Oh, <laughs> <Come on. gasps> oh, there's a secret spot. And if you land the bottle there, you're the number one flipper on the invisible ledge. Yes. I can finally die happy. I got the ultimate secret bottle flip in Happy Wheels. There's nothing else for me to achieve in my life. <laughs> Robbery complete. Okay, it's time for the pogo fight apocalypse. You have to beat all the zombies. They get more and more ridiculous as time goes on. What do you do with that watermelon, little Logan? That's my watermelon. I like how the zombies grow up into actual zombies. Although really all it looks like is they grow up, lose their hair and get leprosy. All right, actual zombie, I'm coming. I'm gonna land it. Yep. 
Okay, I learned the secret. It's using the watermelon to take out the zombies. Clearly zombies are allergic to watermelon. The zombie family, look, <laughs> look at this incredible acrobatics they're putting on. Damn it, damn it, I got a watermelon up my ass. All right, now trying to not piss off the cheerleading pyramid zombie family is, is very difficult. You gotta, hold on, I gotta get down and then one of these, whoop. Well, now we're all, we're all together now, closer than we've ever been. Huh, that looks horrible. Okay, that worked out really well, except for the fact that there is a scimitar just pointing at me. It could also be a cutlass, I'm really not sure. Okay, let me try and not get my head stuck on that. Nice. Jesus, it's a raider, they're upgrading. He's got a fire axe taped to his sword. Sweet. All right, so now all I have to do is just dodge the minefield. Easier done than said. I'd like to take a moment to mention that the mine itself wasn't what killed me. It was the sudden stop at the edge of the board. Damn it, I've got a child stuck on my sword. Get off, get off my sword. All right, I guess, it, I guess he's coming with me. I'd like to take a moment to show everyone that I currently have a sword up my anus with two different heads attached to it. Happy Wheels is always showing me something new and exciting. Is there anything more badass than having a sword coming out of your butt with a person's severed head on it? Well, this is, this is new and exciting. Okay. Yeah. Damn it. Yes, I used a woman's head to save my own life. Now, if only I could get rid of like the seven different blades that are in my rectum. Yes. Oh, oh, okay. I mean, boss fight? No, what is this? Oh, yeah! <laughs> Tried to shove your fist up my rectum, but it didn't work out for you, did it? Hell yes. Sticks to land. Wow, what a pain in my ass that was. I mean, literally, but what a pain that was. All right, so this is a little like forestry uh, restoration project. You gotta grab this log. Okay, we're just cleaning up. Kind of some extra stuff that was laying around the area. And that right there is a victory. Also, we're grilling up hamburgers. Yay, I won the poop throw. This is the first Happy Wheels board that actually gives a supportive statement in the beginning. You can do this. You're damn right we can. You lied to me. All right, Nixon. Get ready, baby. Nice, nice. Oh, we can do it. Santa has turned evil. Little Tom Hardy and I must stop him. All right, Santa, your altruistic ways end today. Your elves can't save you. All right, maybe they can stop me though. Get it. Will you get your little elf ass out of my way? Oh, well, this is embarrassing. Uh, we should have died, but we landed on top of this elf. So technically we're still alive, but there's no way out. So rather than die a slow and painful death down here, I'm gonna just do that. Uh, no! There we go. Where all these elves get these damn butcher knives from? Oh, this is steep. Ha! That's it, Tom, push, push your dad cross the finish line. You can do it, kid. Get it, get there. Oh, no, you, you ripped your arm off. No, you ripped your other arm off, Tom. What the hell are you doing, buddy? Use your nubs, Tom. Use your nubs. Your elven swords will not defeat me this time. There we go. <laughs> he landed on top of the house. See, he's still delivering presents. That wily bastard. This was called Can You Win? And I, I won, I don't really know what the problem was here. Bottle run! <laughs> Bottle run! Come on! <laughs> well, almost all the kids made it. I'm down one daughter. This is a highly rated level called Can You Survive? Goddamn right we can. Why do I feel like this is a... Well. Didn't see that coming. All right, Tom, you may be the only one that can survive. Actually, your dad might leave you behind, ready? 
My head made it. This is what was left of the bike. There's one hypothalamus just sitting on the crossbar. Okay, maybe I can ramp over this. Go, Tom! Get there! <gasps> My heart just went to space. New plan, Tom. I'm gonna do this one alone. Just gonna crab walk my way in, okay? It doesn't know if I stay low. Yeah, I'm gonna make it. I'm gonna make it. Oh, oh, oh. Get your ass over that bump. Yes! <laughs> I mean, half of me made it, so it counts. I got the victory sign. Welcome to the factory. Okay, this isn't too bad so far. Great, now I'm like a factorial hood ornament. Mistime that. No, yes, no. Ooh, ooh. Oh, I'm gonna fall off! Ah. Oh yeah. Okay, it's working, we're getting there. I hope it doesn't get any worse. Uh, oh. Hey! Remember kids, don't drink and drive! Really? Really? Yay, I win. And by win, I mean I slowly get moved into swords that go directly into my balls. Welcome to life or death. Jump to choose. Death or life. He cut down hundreds of trees. Should we, should we let him go or? <laughs> no one's gonna get let go. What an ironic death. I like how family friendly the curse word is considering he just got obliterated. She assassinated John F. Kennedy. I think I can already tell where this is going. Everyone gets death. I said death. Oh God. He killed your mom, penalty is death. Ah. Stole all your money, yeah, it's death. <gasps> I broke my head on the death button. I'm not supposed to die. Now this body is pooping all its blood on top of me. Okay, let's try that again. Hopefully with hopefully with less death on my part. Oh god! Here we go. Now we're getting there. Killed 75 people. Drunk driving 20 times. <laughs> That's what you hit for not getting that bottle flip. Invented drugs. Wait, the good drugs or the bad drugs? Ah, whatever, everyone gets death. World War II. We, we did it! I wanted to see what would happen if you chose life. Can you, oh you can still lie to people and choose death though. So the answer is always death. Death, death. Well, we had to choose life or death, but the truth is the answer is always death and happy wheels. Anyway, folks, hope you enjoyed this episode. Until next time, stay foxy, much love.